So the Vulcan is the gateway to modern freestyle. And it's a move which can be quite frustrating to learn. I'm going to break it down to a few key areas so you can learn it as quickly and as effective as possible. With all the windsurfing moves you learn, there is one stage which is absolutely critical. It's the only point where you have time to change anything and time to get yourself ready. And that is the preparation. So we're going to look at the preparation in detail. The entry and midpoint of the Vulcan come down to a few key bits. The pop, the rotation, and the slide. We're then going to look at how to control it for the exit. So the preparation to the Vulcan is absolutely key. Head across the wind. In fact, the more powered up you are, you might head slightly upwind. You could head a little downwind, but we need to make sure that the board is flat and our body weight's over the board. So heading across the wind, slide your front hand as close to the mast as you possibly can. With your back hand, make sure the rig is really sheeted in, very close to the center line of the board. You may need to move your back hand down the boom slightly. We now need to get our body weight over the board and keep it flat. So bring your head and your harness ahead of the harness lines. We should be right over the center line of the board with the rig super sheeted in. For the pop, it's different to a chop hop. The pop is a weight transfer from the back foot onto the front foot. So we're gonna weight our back foot and we're ready to pop. We're gonna transfer that weight straight onto the front foot. So it's a hip movement more than anything else. So as we pop, sheet in sharply with the back hand and release it. It's now time to make the board rotate. So move the head to look behind you as sharply and quickly as possible. Tuck up with the back leg. This will help the rotation. And with your front hand, drive all your weight down through the mast foot and into the board. As the board rotates, keep that weight down through the boom. And once you grab the other side, we're onto the slide. So make sure you keep the head rotating. Have your new front hand on the boom now. Keep sliding the rig towards the wind and working your hands down the boom. Moving on to the exit, we now need to gently sheet the sail in as the board comes to the end of the slide. We're gonna sink our weight upwind and to the inside. Again, slowly sheeting in until the board starts to move forward. Keep your elbows flexed and keep your weight down through the mast foot. When you feel stable, we can switch the feet. 